Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 4th. Okay, now keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you. What do we have for a message today? At the right place, at the right time. So somebody is going to find themselves at the right place, at the right time. It's like serendipity, right? Five of Pentacles reversed. Magician reversed. So, no help. There's no help or there's a no answer. No. This is not what you asked for. No, this is not what you asked for. Five of Pentacles reversed is a turning point, however. There's been some sort of hardship, maybe financial hardship or financial burden or uh, being left out in the cold. You didn't ask for that, right? You didn't ask for that. You didn't ask to be ghosted. You didn't ask to be left out in the cold. But you may have chosen to be left out in the cold. You, you, could, have, you could have went someplace else, but you chose not to. You chose to be a victim to this circumstance. You chose to, right? You chose to. There's no success with the magician reversed, right? There's, that's not successful, not taking any action, not doing anything. So we have somebody here that has been allowing themselves to be a victim. They've chosen to be a victim. They've chosen to not get help or not ask for help. But there may be some help arriving. May not be exactly what you asked for. Now the Knight of Pentacles is a generous offer. It's not exactly what you asked for. But it's something real. It's something solid. It's something stable. It's something that you can hold on to. But you have to be open. You, you can't allow yourself to be a victim to your current circumstances. You can choose not to accept it. You can choose to say no. But don't cry when the opportunity passes you by. King of Cups. Queen of Pentacles. So this is something that is very real. This is emotionally fulfilling. Whoever is making this offer has good intentions. They're acting from their heart. This is somebody that is very kind hearted and has a very big heart that is giving somebody a solid, stable opportunity. Definitely generous. The Queen of Pentacles is somebody that is very generous, very hardworking, has something of value to offer. 
that's in the future, taking the opportunity. That's after the King of Cups. This Queen of Pentacles is going to take, it goes the Knight of Pentacles, the King of Cups, and the Queen of Pentacles. There's an offer that is coming that is probably going to be taken. This leads to stability and security. Queen of Cups. Four of Cups and Justice Reversed. Hierophant Reversed on the bottom. The Hierophant Reversed on the bottom could be relationship problems, commitment issues. Somebody may be in a commitment where there's no success. They're feeling lack, they're being neglected. There's a golden opportunity here for emotional fulfillment and security. It's a perfect match, but it's being ignored. It's an injustice. It's an injustice. We have somebody here that is not making the right decision. That's a poor decision, justice reversed. They're losing a golden opportunity. It is a big opportunity. They're missing the opportunity for love. It's like they're saying no. They're saying no to this golden opportunity because they've been led down the wrong path by an individual that is not very awakened, that is not very skilled, that is emotionally manipulative. <laughs> I feel like We have somebody here that is looking for love. They're looking for a relationship. They've been ignored. They've been ghosted. They've been neglected. They've been abandoned. They've been unwilling to take action up until now because I feel like there is a generous offer that is coming in that is now gonna be taken because there's no resolution in sight with whoever it is that has abandoned them. There's some sort of unfair, this isn't fair, this is unjust, it's not fair. There's an argument with no resolution in sight. This is, this is like not being honest. Somebody hasn't been honest with themselves. And now it's like, I can't ignore the truth anymore. Somebody has been ignoring the truth. They've been in denial. They've been in a state of illusion. But it goes from illusion to reality. It goes from, it does, it goes from illusion to reality. It goes from fluid to real. This is getting real, getting to the truth, getting to the truth.
laying a new foundation not planned unplanned there's something happening that is uh, it's unexpected help arriving or it is it's unexpected unplanned with the magician reverse that's unplanned five of pentacles reverse is help so we got some unexpected or unplanned help and then we get the knight of pentacles which is a solid offer from somebody that this is a very generous offer. This is somebody that works really, really hard, that has some sort of skill. We also have an individual that is, is it's almost like this person is sitting back and they're looking at somebody. They're looking at somebody and they're like, I know that's my perfect match. I know that's my perfect match. I know that it is. But they've been ignoring it. They've been ignoring it. Not taking any action. And because they've been ignoring it, I feel... Like somebody else is going to take it. There's going to be an expression. There's going to be a conversation. Somebody is going to be having a conversation with somebody. They don't see it coming. It's completely unexpected. It's like you're not looking for it. You're not looking for it. We may have somebody here that's focused on their business. They're focused on their, their home. They're focused on their finances. They're focused on their job. They're focused on their money. They're not looking for a relationship. Unplanned. Completely unplanned. Something is happening. It is completely unplanned. Somebody is getting a real solid opportunity that is going to make them extremely happy it is ah seven of cups reverse seeing very very clearly that's becoming clear of a choice somebody has been ignoring their intuition They've been ignoring themselves. They've been or their, their 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 feelings. They've been ignoring their intuition themselves. Same thing. They've been missing an opportunity. Not interested. Completely not interested. Not not interested at all. We have somebody here that has not been interested. But now there's some sort of opportunity. But the Seven of Cups is seeing very clearly that this is a perfect choice. It's becoming clear of the choice. Somebody was ignoring something, but now they see. It's like, now I see that this is, this is a perfect match. This is a perfect match. Making a decision based on the feelings, based on the heart, based on stability as well. So somebody is making a heartfelt decision that has to do with what their heart wants, but also what is the most stable, solid, real thing to do. The most practical, the most responsible thing to do. It's a realistic decision. It is. But it also comes from the heart. We have somebody here that has been confused. They've been in some sort of a state of illusion with the Seven of Cups. But now it's like seeing very, very clearly and making an offer. It almost feels like somebody 
I mean, somebody may run into somebody or something like that, but this is like making an offer. Somebody is making an offer. They are. Somebody is making an offer. It's completely unplanned. They're making an offer to somebody that is quite content. This person, you know, may not be looking for a relationship, but I think this person's going to take the offer, which is surprising. Um, Seven of Cups reverse, seeing very clearly that this is the right choice. Coming out of confusion, making the choice, making a decision. King of Wands reversed. We have several players here several people involved and that's why we have a seven of cups there's so many options here angry we have somebody here that is going this is not fair this is not fair somebody is gonna is losing an opportunity they are this king of wands is losing an opportunity they are and it's because they can't make a decision this king of wands reverse it is indecisive the, the justice card reversed they don't want an opportunity. They're mit they're going to lose it. They're losing the opportunity. Naive. They have somebody here that can't see. They can't they have no vision. It's like they can't see. This person is it's a poor decision with the justice reversed. It's right with the justice reversed. This is like, this is a poor decision. Somebody has made a poor decision or they are making a poor decision because they're losing a golden opportunity to somebody else. Whoever it is that they are ignoring or that they aren't, that they've ghosted or neglected, whoever it is that they aren't giving to is going, is receiving an offer from somebody else. We have a turning point here, seeing an improvement. Somebody, somebody is going to be receiving something that they totally do not expect. There's been some sort of injustice here. Somebody has been reluctant to take action. I mean, I don't know, maybe this person has been confused. Maybe they've been confused. You know, they didn't know what to do. Maybe maybe this King of Wands in reverse has been naive. You know, he's been confused. He's been disillusioned. I mean, the Seven of Cups right, right next to it, that's disillusioned, that's confused. You know, exploring options not making the right decision, poor decisions, lacking integrity, not doing the right thing, not wanting to be held accountable for their actions. We have somebody here that doesn't want to be held accountable for their actions. So they've been ignoring an opportunity for love. They've been ignoring it or missing an opportunity and they're sad. This person is sad. They're angry. They're upset. Maybe they know. Maybe their intuition is telling them that Whoever it is that they have neglected or abandoned is taking another opportunity. This person has been struggling with making a decision. They've been indecisive. 
they've been led down a, they it's like the blind leading the blind they've been led down a path where you know they're lacking they're lacking financial stability they're dealing with financial hardship because they're not acting with integrity they're getting bad karma whoever this person is is in a situation they're in a situation just for stability reasons and they're getting karma like they are the justice reverse next to that king of wands reverse they're getting a lot of karma there's probably a lot of financial problems because when you don't act with integrity that's where karma will usually hit you it will usually hit you in the purse in the pocketbook because obviously that's what you're focusing on more than love So this is like an unplanned uh, loss of some sort. We have somebody here that is definitely not acting with integrity. No success. They're not having any success and no financial success because they're not acting with integrity. Whoever it is that they have abandoned or neglected or whatever it is, is receiving a solid offer that leads to stability. Whoever this King of Wands is in reversed and it doesn't have to be a king it doesn't have to be an aries leo sagittarius it could be anybody this person is going to be angry with an outcome they are not going to be happy with an outcome justice is reversed right next to it they're not going to be happy they are not going to be happy with an outcome because they're it's it's like they're not acting with integrity somebody's not doing the right thing they're not doing the right thing they're they're doing something that is against the law, right? And maybe, maybe it's the karmic law. There's consequences with the Seven of Cups. There is some sort of consequences here. Queen of Pentacles has something in her hands. This is a solid opportunity that leads to abundance it leads to something stable and secure she has manifested something so somebody has manifested something solid stable and secure below her is the king of wands reversed this isn't fair right between the both of them off to the side is justice reversed that's this isn't fair this is this isn't fair this isn't this is like an outcome not going in somebody's favor this is angry upset that it didn't go you know the karma has no toleration for lies has no toleration for uh disrespect and uh breaking the law you know that somebody has broken the law whatever they've done they've broken the law and they're going to be experiencing some sort of karma for doing so they're losing something of value it's like it's going to be given to somebody else it's almost like we have somebody here that may come with an offer but it may be too late. It may be too late. It's like we have this person that is making an offer. But it's too late. I feel like it's too late. It's too late. It's too late. You didn't do the right thing when it was time. You wasted time being in fantasy land, choosing another option. I 
I mean, as Queen of Pentacles, she knows her value. She's holding on to her value. Empress. Oh, yes, she's holding on to her value. Absolutely. The Empress is the queen of all queens, right? She knows her value. She's beautiful. She's, she's, knows her value. She's, she, she does. So the Empress, she has multiple options, which is very clear right next to the Seven of Cups. She has multiple options. She's beautiful. She's glowing. She's giving birth to a new life. This is beautiful. Nurturing, loving, caring. Creative. We have a creator here that is in the process of creating a new life. And I feel like they are no longer interested in the person that is about to make them an offer because they've went through a period of growth and they don't want to be treated unfairly. So anyway, we have an empress here that is in the process of creating a new life. This is this is like this is like a mother, right? This is unconditional love. It starts with self-love. This empress is also receiving she's receiving multiple offers. She is receiving multiple she always has multiple offers. The empress has multiple offers because everybody wants the empress Everybody wants the Empress because she's she's nurturing, she's loving, she knows she knows her value. She doesn't she doesn't sleep around, she doesn't uh have multiple partners, right? She takes care of herself. She knows her value. She takes care of everything. I mean, the Empress takes care of everything. She takes care of herself. She takes care of her children. She takes care of her home. She nurtures things with love. So we do have an Empress here that is receiving an offer. She's beautiful. This is creating a new life. It's time. This is a miracle. It's a blessing. Somebody is receiving a blessing that they have waited for. It is definitely time. There is an offer of love that is coming. It is real. And I feel like this Empress is rejecting somebody. I feel like she's telling somebody no. Now it's underneath the Magician Reverse. That's a no answer. No. It's too late. You ghosted me. You neglected me. You abandoned me. You gave your love to somebody else. I'm not interested. Hold it on to my value. Good luck.